Welcome back to and this guides in today's video we are going to show you how to set up robot self-assigned emoji reaction roles in discord let's begin now the first thing you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time in discord click the register option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go now setting up robots self-assigned emoji reaction roles in discord involves a few steps because probot is a bot framework for creating discord bots and self-assigned emoji reaction roles allow users to assign themselves roles by creating two messages with specific emojis now the first thing you need to do is to install probot on your discord server now we have a separate video on how to set up levels on discord using probot so you might want to check in our channel for previous topics but the thing is from here you need to go to this specific website called probot.io basically it is a website that makes customizable multi-purpose bot for welcome image in depth logs social commands moderation and many more especially in terms of the setup self-assigned emoji reaction roles now all you have to do if you haven't already is click the, the add to discord all right but what will happen is you will be redirected to a new page wherein you are authorizing probot to your discord account and from here all you have to do is just allow all these permissions of probot to your discord server and of course you need to select the discord server that you are going to use that into in my case i'm going to be choosing again the andy guides how to's all right i need you to click on it and click on continue and of course you can confirm the grant permissions that you wanted for um probot to your discord account if you if you don't like it you can you know just uh, put some customization here and just select the permissions that you wanted but if you're okay with that all you're gonna do is click on authorize but the thing is i have already authorized probot in the uh, previous topic what will happen is i will be redirected here on the probot dashboard now once you are successfully in let's of course set up robot self-assigned emoji reaction rules all right now from here the next step is now the first thing from here is to go to the embed messages and create a new embedded message all right now i'm now i'm gonna click of the create an embed here and let's say i'm gonna rename this one as a self-assigned emoji reaction kind of like that okay and then and then after that let's maybe put some uh message here on the uh and you can assign a color for this one i'm gonna choose uh this color right here you can assign name of course that's gonna be um this one the role and description all right and from here you can also send a new message in this one and save changes we will see what's going to happen from here. Now, once you have saved the channel, you might want to click on the send new message and choose a channel. And that's going to be where it's up to you on your discretion where you wanted to test this new message. Now, for example, I'm going to be choosing the uh, sir, this channel in a specific uh, server and click on that. And then what will happen is. Now, after sending the new message, we might want to switch over to the uh, Discord app. Now, once I'm here on the Discord server, as you can see, the uh, setup robot self assigned emoji has been sent. All right. Now, when you switch over to your robot dashboard again, you would see there's a self assigned roles here. If you click on it again, you can also add a message similar to the uh, content that we have created earlier you can add a message and you can edit all right so well, let's do that for now and you can limit the roles per user say for example we're gonna be have like five you can toggle can give and take all right and after that click on save 
you can select an embed or of course this is the uh, fun part you can self-assign emoji reaction and again you can select a message wherein you can select the uh, channel of vip per cell and that's going to be uh, dependent on your channel that you are going to use and once you're happy with that click on save changes but i suggest you check on more options at the bottom you can uh, on the role mode you have the option for toggle this mode allows or removes roles based on whether the user has the roles which is recommended i suggest you use this one but if it's not if you don't like it you might want to click the give this mode adds the roles whenever a reaction is added or removed great for accepting roles and take uh, this mode removes uh, the roles whenever a reaction is added or removed all right and in terms of the notification type you can notify to take a member attention by replying the user interaction all right you can add it remove zero and of course in terms of the silent you can self assign without any reply when we click on the uh, save changes right you need to select an embed all right this one and okay this one click on save changes right so now the uh, self-assigned emoji reaction roles has been saved to your Pearlbot dashboard all right now the next step is now if you wanted to edit the embed messages for the self-assigned emoji reactions you might want to click on these option right here go to embed and of course you can put another title if you wanted for example let's use this one and you can also add the picture here now to make it more dynamic and of course you, you can add another field here if you wanted but that's going to be for a different uh, video that's a little bit of advanced uh, tutorial about self-assigned emoji reaction roles and you're happy with that click on save changes and again you can always test the message click on send new message that's going to be for this one let's try to send another one and it's success let's check on the discord app and voila this is how you set up robot self-assigned emoji reaction roles in discord i believe that's it for today's video thank you so much for watching and we will see you again in the next one